Check it out. Yeah, you're being recorded. Whoa, there you are. Yeah. All right. So, uh, hey, um, tell us about uh, your application. Oh, is that it right there? Or are you ready to go just to talk about it? Yeah. So well, I'll tell you what. Oh, we'll let them just talk about it, and then when they're finished talking about it, then we'll open it up for questions. How's that sound? Okay. He, oh, Ahmed, he needs it back. He wants to. Oh, Ahmed. Oh, he needs it back. He needs it back. Yeah. <laughs> he needs it back. There you go. <laughs> Hey, yeah, tell us about your idea. Uh, you, would you like to go first, Mr. John? Yeah? All right. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Oh, that'd be very nice. Yeah. It's, it's, it's about uh, people who Ooh. died when they reach a similar age to the gun. Oh. <laughs> okay. Stop smoking. I hear you. So the purpose is to help people stop smoking, yeah. is that right? All right, yeah. How do you, okay. No. No. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you part of it too? Yeah, you want to explain some more? Yeah, uh, yeah you're, is this kind of your idea? Definitely, I'll have a gun. Uh -huh. uh, with cigarettes. Okay. So when you shoot people with uh, the cigarettes, we die. Oh, I see. <laughs> so people are avoid smoking. Oh, okay. When they play this game. It has a bullet there, period. I like that. You, you like that idea? Well, okay. That Bruce sounds like fun. But pollution. Pollution? Pollution. <laughs> pollution? It's pollute. Yeah, it's a pollutant. Okay. Pollution. Pollution? Is that this one? Oh, I'm not sure what you're saying. Pollution?
So, so if you if you uh, move a uh, like chocolate, ah, oh, interesting. So if you move the chocolate, uh, moving the candy and the and chocolate is different than moving yes, the vegetables. Yes, this is a chocolate, mm. and we have to put it on candy. Mm. So this type of candy, it will become this, and the whole line will get chocolate. Follow that one. Okay. And that's different than the way that uh, the vegetables and the, and the uh, fruit mm. work too. Is that right? Yes. You don't agree? Oh. Hmm? <laughs> All right. All right. What do you call Candy it? Crush. Candy Crush Sa Saga. Okay. Well, that name has already been taken. Maybe like Veggie Crush or something. Yeah. <laughs> hey, so. Already that. Yeah, that's right. Uh, maybe. Okay. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. good. Yeah, I tell you what. Yeah, if you want to keep the name, we'll just call it. Can there we go. Can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, no. Hey, lovely, lovely idea. Hey, uh, now tell me, um, how will, um, how will this not only be fun, like your game is fun, how will it help people, uh, maybe start thinking differently about health and stuff like that? Like, if we eat one candy. <laughs> uh huh. If we eat one candy, then. Like I'm trying to in for children, like oh, I know. From yeah. they will be growing up, they will be learning to eat vegetables, don't eat candy. So the that's the that's original game is only about the candies, it's not right. about the vegetables. I understand, but yeah. Can in that. a different way, like if we sing, yeah, we can think it like that. I see. I, I just w I, I think you're I think I uh, understood your game to be like your um the uh there's an association of like candy and chocolate as being kind of a uh, uh, not a benefit in the game. Yes. Am I right? Mm -hmm. About having vegetables and fruit, uh, you, you want to get more of those? Yes. And that, is that uh, Okay, I get it. Start associating healthy foods as a benefit in the game and and then uh, you, you want to avoid the these avoid in the game. Avoid the chocolate and put it on the candy so the whole line gets crushed. That means oh. we are hurting ourselves by eating. So you, you get a lot of points for that? Yeah? Yes, we oh. get points. Okay, got a lot of points for removing the removing, chocolate. Removing, yes. Ah, I gotcha. All right, fair enough, cool. And so that acts differently than the fruit and vegetables. Yes. Yes. Ah, I get it now. That's actually not a bad idea. That could really maybe be a neat idea. You start associating fruits and vegetables with fun. Hey, nice, cool. You agree, Zoe? Good. Mm -hmm. Close enough. I heard it's terrible. All right, all right, all right. Uh, did you gentlemen come up with something? Uh, Toki, did you guys come up with something? Oh, you were, oh, you were four away, Yeah. He puts the oh. morning in the company, no more. You put it on the That's right, yeah. Uh, I, think, I think he was saying, like, he's, 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 the he's the guy who brings the money and you're the spokesperson. Yeah, you'll be the, yeah. <laughs> he's in that thing, you know. It's all her idea. And you're going to finance it, I guess, is the idea, right? <laughs> sure. Hey, I like that. That's neat. Um, cool. Any more comments or questions or ideas or. No? Yeah? But we have games like this, right? Yeah, tell me more. No, but we have a game like this. Already. Game like Candy Crush? No, uh, healthy oh. game. Tell me more, like what? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> 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 no, I have seen yeah. like oh, or vegetables or some uh -huh. diet game. Uh huh. Like two quiz, like a quiz. Oh, tell me more, I didn't understand it. Yeah, yeah. It's a game or app. I didn't I don't know, know the oh. name and all that stuff. Okay. But it, I heard I saw it somewhere that this My type of game. But someone has already made this type of game. Someone's already been yeah. thinking about that sort of thing. Okay, I gotcha. Oh, all right. Oh, uh, fair enough. Um, what about your game? Yeah. It's a Euro Euro. Mira y Tamaliosa. I'm going to say it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, he <laughs> told me that he was part of your group. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> just going to like, uh, <laughs> actually, we gave the whole idea for this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Um, okay, so, uh, by the way, b before we do that, uh, the, 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 the TV show, uh, next week, of course, is uh, actually the last week of instruction. Uh, uh, it's just unit uh, eight uh, will be like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Um, we'll, uh, we'll just focus on unit eight and a Thursday next week, one week from today. Mm -hmm. uh, you'll have a listening uh, test. Yeah. Five minutes? Uh, now, that, that's, no. that's your last test. Oh, right. Last, last test. test and then the final. When you will reassign? I missed one. That's good. good question. Right. I was going to say it. Yeah. There are, um, okay, so next week, Monday, okay, in addition to assigning all of the homework for Unit 8, like normal, right, um, 
Yeah, you're gonna have a listening test and then also a, 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 a speaking okay. test on Thursday. Um, next Thursday. Next, uh, next Thursday. Thursday. Right. And then um, the week after that, week nine is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, uh, and all of that is just compass testing. Okay. Compass test. Yeah. Uh, th th there's gonna be finals. Yeah. There's final yeah. exams. Uh, is your other teacher giving you finals too? Yeah. Geneva. Geneva. But she's waiting for you. This day we are giving. I, I talked to her already about that. So okay. Uh, anyway, these last three days, the computer lab is being used for what they call compass testing. It's the school gives it. It doesn't affect the grade in my class, okay. but uh, one of the requirements for going on to the next level is yeah, passing the classes and passing a uh, compass okay. test. It's like a, um, an evaluation uh, the tool. The, it's an online. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a computer listening and grammar. And also writing test. It doesn't evaluate your speaking, though. Uh, but anyway, the, the, the school administrators give it. Okay. If you have more questions about compass tests, then maybe you could you know, ask the folks in the office. But anyway, that happens all that week. And so people are they're, they're trying to get everybody in the school to come into these two rooms. Um, and so you'll be doing that. Also, maybe uh, Geneva will be giving a final exam. And, and so these last three days, actually, um, th next week, Thursday, you'll be, you will be finished will follow my grades, okay. okay? These last three days I can use for review and help you prepare for Geneva's thing, or, or we can uh, do some review from old vocabulary from previous units, um, all right? And, uh, but, but, uh, but, this, but this unit, this, this I'm sorry, this uh, semester, we only had four tests. There's no, there's no final exam with me. You, know. you don't have No, I won't have an, a last one, no. But just, just four only, unit two, unit Four, unit six, unit eight, two, four, six, eight. So we completed three. There is only one left, right? Correct. Right. You've done three okay, already. So the next week we will complete that test also. Okay. Right. And then and you take that out the average of that test. Uh, oh, that oh, that that system, I don't know. Exactly. Right. 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 What? <laughs> 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 so anyway, the uh, <laughs> so at that point, yes, uh, I'll he be. He means he uh, like. I automatically that gets updated in your yeah, that's that all the that's average. That's what I said in Hindi. He said in Hindi. <laughs> I, I think I figured that's what you're asking. Yeah. Um, yes. Um, so your um, so y yeah, your 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 actual grade. Okay, there's there's three different types. There's uh, there's homework. Uh, homework is is that forty marks. Yeah, forty percent. Correct. Yeah, forty percent. Um, and then you know, test grades, which there are a total of four. So each test, each test is a lot, and that represents 50 percent. Okay. And the last one is uh, participation, 10 percent, and attendance basically. And um, for um, and actually, nobody in here has a problem with that. But all these uh, all these jokers who have been uh, goofing around on their phones and leaving whatever, uh, they're going to have a bad participation <laughs> rate. <laughs> you folks who have been here engaged in using this time properly, you're going to. It only represents ten percent. Okay. But not attendance. Who are not present today will get ten percent. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry about it. Yeah, if you're here, you're participating. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about that. You, none of it. Nobody in here has to worry about this. And this is a small part of it. Participation represents. I'll look at uh, the attendance record, but also I'll um, I'll look. You know, I'll how consider. You want to yeah, how you participated and things okay. like that. Okay, so uh, but anyway, the majority of your grade is like to answer your question is already on my English lab. Yeah, uh, to answer your question, yes, uh, Monday you in addition to the homework you will also be uh, given uh, some makeup work. Uh, some people uh, miss some of the assignments on uh, Unit 1 or Unit 2. Um, if anybody had a zero on any assignment, a zero, not a bad grade, but a zero, on, on any previous unit, mm -hmm. Unit 1, Unit 2, for three, for whatever reason, you missed it or you didn't do it, I'm going to put it all here and it will be, the makeup stuff will be available until that week, month, uh, Wednesday next week, all right? So next week you'll have a a lot of stuff. Unless you've been keeping up with all of it, then you'll only have Unit 8. What's up, Toby? The first unit I completed 58% and I save it. And it was disappeared. So what should I do? Well, you saying that so you yeah. need to zero. Right. I, I'm going to look at your, your, your thing specifically. I'm going to okay. look at your, your anything. I haven't done first unit. But you, Pardon? Got zero, right? you got zero. You got zero, then you have I to do it. I, I will. I, 
Yes, you got a zero in any assignment. Uh, I will assign it one more time, and okay. you'll have a second chance to do it, okay. but a shorter amount of time to do okay. it. Yeah. So, but anyway, um, so uh, I'm saying like the next couple of weeks, you you have opportunity to raise your grade if you're concerned about it. Uh, all of it mostly on myenglishlab.com. Uh, I'm sorry. Any questions about anything? Is that making sense? Did you hear that? Maybe they're looking at. What I want to do? I completed half only. Half Okay, right. And don't worry about it. Yeah, uh, this weekend I'll uh, I'll put it in here, and you'll get this chance like all next week, uh, as well as uh, those last three days. Yeah, you can uh, work on that. And so, in fact, actually, these last three days, excuse me, sorry. If you want to, when you come to class, you just want to go straight to the computer if it's available. So on last yeah. three days, when is our campus test? The campus test? Wednesday or Thursday? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the campus schedule yet. Any uh, no, 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 they're, they're going to assign it for certain levels. I think level one, maybe Monday, or level one, two, or three might be on Monday. I, I don't know how they're going to do that. They might start at the top, maybe, you know, TOEFL. Actually, if I, if I think about it, I think TOEFL is on Monday. It's a, it's a very long one. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, that's, does that make sense for everybody? Yeah, yeah. okay, super. There you go. There you go. Here, what do you mind uh, passing this round? Make sure we get one. Thank you, sir. You're a good helper. Asiana, I like your idea for a game. I really do. That's kind of neat. Like a cigarette death, too. What do you think? Is that a, what's the name of your game? You want to call it a cigarette death? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. That's cool. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that would just that would just be popular because it's kind of ridiculous. It's kind of funny. By <laughs> I guess it's just the first one. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct. Yeah, a lot of people. Uh, like we all, it was, it went away, right? Like it was new, so we were doing slowly, and it did something. Right. right. We were getting people <laughs> registered. Okay, and so we'll do that again. Correct. Yeah. This uh, weekend, I'll reassign it, and you'll get the second chance. All, all week, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, it'll, okay. it'll be in um, what they call the uh, uh, the to-do list. You go to home, it'll be in to-do list. It'll be, I'll make it very simple for you, okay? Those are tests. And these all are tests, right? That's correct. Those are the tests. You've had three so and far. Again, it will, uh, yeah, that's will again get That's good. Uh, cool. Okay. All right. Um, Seventy or higher is passing. But keep in mind, uh, also if you pass the cla my class and Janine's this class, but also in order to go to the next level, you also have to pass the, the compass test. Yeah. Um, I I don't have any study guide for what's on the compass test exactly. Uh, it, but maybe other people who have taken it before uh, can tell you about it. This you've never taken the compass, is that right? Yeah. No. You know what this is? Yeah. Don't worry about it, right? I wouldn't worry about it.
And she right. gives us the right. written text. Right. 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 right all the time. All right. She does yeah. give the homework, but she does not update. She says she's going to update it, so I'll not update it. Uh, uh, so she's not using the mind lab anymore. No. Right. Uh, she's giving the written work. Okay. But that's, uh, but you don't know what you're grading. We don't know what we are grading. What we fail is something we have not done. She doesn't tell us. So one of them is, both of them mean change your mind. 
So I don't know which one is number one. Either back down or back out. Right. Yeah. Backing down is like there's a fight and then someone gives up. Backing out is kind of like we will meet together and then it's like no, uh, then they don't come okay. and one person is is by themselves. Does that make sense? Sorry. Yeah. So I don't know. Back out or back down. One of those. And we'll actually we'll, we'll talk about it after the show. Okay. So are you gonna, and you know what gonna means. Gonna, gonna, yeah. Going to, going to yeah, right. Right. Going are you going to, to hmm, my heart out? Are you going to take everything away from me? Are you going to break my heart? Are you going to make me feel really sad? Are you going to, uh, what are these words down here? What do you think? Leave my heart. Good guess. No, it's not leave. It is a verb. Oop. Something, my heart out. Uh, imagine this. So someone reaches into your chest and yeah, rip. There we go. Rip. This is lit. This is literally. This is literally ripping. That's ripping. That's tearing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> same, same thing. That's <laughs> tearing. But yeah, this is tearing. And this is ripping. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Violent. Yeah. Violent. Imagine Violent. this. Yeah. Ha ha. Someone's heart, you tear it out violently. This is the uh, idea of violence. It, it violently breaking someone's heart somehow. Yeah, not literally killing someone by you know, pulling their heart out. So everybody say, are you going to rip my heart out? Are you going to? Let's gonna try that. Are you going to rip my heart out? The same thing is breaking my heart, but it's more violent. It's just more, uh, much more deeper. Yes, sir. Sure. Writing is it is yeah. They put gonna here. You're right. In writing, that wouldn't be correct. Uh, yeah. The the purpose of this one is for listening comprehension so much. But right. Yeah. You don't want to you don't want to write gonna unless it's on Facebook or something or a text message. That's appropriate. But uh, yeah, you'd want to write going to. Uh, yeah. That's you don't want to do the uh, what's it called the reduction. Uh, that's kind of we practiced yesterday. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, was that actually what you were asking about? Well, whenever you write gonna, you, you yeah. count it wrong. Even when I just write, even when I just want, it just doesn't want, yeah. yeah. Right, because that's not actually not a word. <laughs> yeah, a written word. Spoken, it is. Yeah. All right. Um, okay, so I feel so hmm and peppy, energetic. I feel so snappy and peppy. Snappy, there you go. Snappy. So this is a snap, by the way. This is snap. And peppy may be thinking about pepper, right? Like spicy something. Snappy. Energy. Peppy is kind of like <laughs> yeah, I feel energized. It's kind of like when you drink your Red Bull, right? How did you s describe it? I always feel activated. That's what you said, right? <laughs> peppy, snappy. So everybody say, I feel so. Everybody say, I feel so. I feel, I feel so. so. Snappy. 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 Yeah, and peppy. Snappy. Yeah. Uh, putting e at the end makes it, it makes it an adjective. This is a snap, and pepper is like spices. And spices. Spicy. It makes it an adjective. I am snappy, which is you know feel energetic. <laughs> Not peppy here. Not snappy. Uh, I'm going to hmm out the most important ingredient. Uh, I'm not going to hmm out. I won't forget to include. Leave. There we Leave. go. There we Leave. go. Leave out. Leave. So there's a lot of phrasal verbs. There's back out or back down. Number one is back out or Can back down. I don't know. Are you going to rip my heart out? I feel so snappy and peppy. Snappy and peppy. Everybody say, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Leave out. That means to leave out means to not include. Yeah? Don't leave. If you leave a person out, that means you don't let them participate. Yeah? If you leave out an ingredient, it means you don't put it in. Cool? Another phrase alert, so it's leave out. Cool. All right. So bring it hmm. on. Yay. Bring That's on. right. This is something we use in sports bring all on. the time. Yeah, bring, bring it on. on. Or uh, yeah, I am ready. Let's do this. All right. You all can you can also use that when someone uh, challenges you to a fight. It's like, I want to fight you. <laughs> bring it on. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready to fight you. So that's the second meaning, you know, it's like I'm ready to eat something good or something, or I'm ready to fight you. Yeah. All right, you have till the, the count, count of three. The count of three, right? Y'all, <laughs> y'all know how that works. It's like, 
Right. Two to three, one to three. Uh, right, yeah, exactly. So you look at a little, usually you tell a little kid. And yeah. Like, oh, one, two, one. Ready, exactly. Ready, yeah. get set, go. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like maybe it's a game. Okay, when I hear you have until the count of three, until the count of three. Um, that means, so what you were describing is that you're going to go at the count of three, uh, at uh, the count of three. So, ready? One, two, three, go. go. You know, that's that. Uh, but until, until the count of, uh, of three, that means um, uh, one, two, three, three here, no, there's going to be a problem. Uh, there's going to be a punishment. It's what you do to a child. It says, okay, put it down. One, two, two three. Three. Yeah. three. Yeah. Remember yeah. everybody's yeah. parents have done this? Yeah. Like, oh, okay, okay, make a decision fast. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. That's that's what they're saying. Yeah. Until the count of three. Same thing? Let me show you. Uh, oh, oh, I'm still recording. Sorry.